High school Chinese series, no matter how many years have passed, are always popular because of Fra Nang's cute school uniform outfits chemistry that matches watching it reminds me of school age love. Why didn't I meet handsome older people when I was studying? But it's okay, although we didn't have any sweet little moments during our school days, but we can still be satisfied with the series as if she were the heroine in the series. Today, we collect up to 11 things to watch. Get ready to be satisfied for a long time all year long. The Comic Bang, Ping Loves Mister. The Comic Bang, a Chinese high school series, follows Liu Yechi, a selfless second year student with a dream of becoming a professional manga artist. He meets Zhuo Tai, a secretly interested woman, and they become friends. Ye Qi pulls Chan Dai to join his manga team, and they develop a strong relationship. The series, adapted from a Japanese manga, is a cute love and friendship story that encourages viewers to overcome obstacles and pursue their dreams. This story about the monk-woman couple is very cute. I recommend it. It is expected that there will be a total of 36 episodes. You can watch them through EGE. Promise in the Summer Summer Promise, a 24-episode miniseries, our male lead has a strange disease that the opposite sex cannot approach. But then, there was an event that changed his life when he met our female lead, who broke into his house and found out the truth about a strange disease that happened to him. What will the whole next story be like? We have to wait and see. The story is very fun to follow. Bright Time Bright Time is very proud to be presented as a male friendship series with 35 episodes. Lan Jinghui's play by Hao Fu Shen placed at the bottom of the class, and Ling Tong's play by Bian Cheng took first place in the year's class. They are both cousins, but they have completely different personalities and preferences. The two had to overcome obstacles and pressures together. Both want to study family problems. It's a youth style series that you can watch over and over again without getting bored. You can watch it on Mango TV. Exclusive Fairy Tale A Lovely Fairy Tale Exclusive Fairy Tale A Lovely Fairy Tale that tells about the relationship between Ling Chao, played by Wen Junhui, and Xiao Tu, played by Zhang Miao Yi. The two have grown up together as rivals since childhood. Ling Chao was a determined and hardworking person. Everything he does has to be perfect. From birth, he knew that his mother liked women so it always develops itself, and with his parents not having much time for their family, he has a personality that is older than his age, polite and mature. He only has one friend, Xiao Tu. As they start to grow up, will their friendship turn into love or not? Have to wait and follow. Until Our 10 Years Until Our 10 Years tells about the four heirs of the city, Wen Clan, Wen Shi Guan, Yan Clan, Yan Chi Clan, Lu Clan, Lu Liun Clan, and Xin Chi Clan. The four Nan Da Yi have been good friends since childhood, but now Wen Heng, played by Yang Ji Yi, the youngest daughter of the White family, was sent to a small town to recover from her illness. After 10 years have passed, Yan Chi is played by Zhe Yuan Sun. She fell in love with Wen Heng at first sight. The two developed a relationship that even started at the same university. And after graduating, he started his own business. But then, the story turns when there is competition in business. A friendship has broken down. What will the next story be? You must follow the story to know what comes next. Always have, always will. This drama revolves around the two as they relive their high school years. Their reunion starts their story as they recover the moments they once lost together. Small town girl Fang Li 
befriended the school's smartest guy, Luo Yan, in high school. To Fang Li, their friendship wasn't actually a good one. Luo Yan was too smart and intimidating, and she saw him as a nightmare. All I want for love is you. Gu Xiaoman, a champion kickboxing fighter in high school, struggles academically and is worried about her graduation. Fortunately, her school's genius and crush, Zuo An, tutors her and helps her graduate. As they reach university, sparks fly between them and their long harbored feelings may be realized. Witness their journey to discover their true love. A little thing called first love. This story of self-discovery and love follows an ordinary girl, Xia Miao Miao. She develops feelings for her handsome and talented senior, Liang Yunyan. To overcome her shyness and become closer to him, she decides to step out of her comfort zone. With the help of her friends, she learns more about fashion and starts to join clubs. She even starts to study harder for better grades. Her first love inspired her to paint her ordinary life in bright colors, and every day becomes more exciting and fun. The Endless Love While preparing for an international arts competition, an accident happens that makes him very worried. At this time, he gets to know the cute and amiable Lu Yu Yan. She will help him heal his mind and fight for his dream of becoming a recognized painter. Ray of Light Ray of Light is a youth school drama about how Nan, an unruly teacher, and a group of students with different personalities who pursue their dreams together. After five years away from the education industry, Hao Nan returns to teaching after running a failed shop. Ren Zhen, an 18-year-old who failed the entrance exams, meets Hao Nan on rooftops and shares his personal experiences. As Hao Nan becomes head of senior class 14, they gradually open their hearts and trust each other. Hao Nan understands each student's dreams and values, acting as a watchman in a weak field helping them fight for their future and achieve their bright lives. When I Fly Towards You When I Fly Towards You is a youth school drama that tells the story of a cheerful girl, Su Zhai Zhai, who sees a fool walking in the rain on the first day of high school and falls in love with him at first sight. We hope you enjoyed looking through this list. Are you already familiar with some of them? Which one are you most excited to watch? If you know of other great Chinese school dramas, make sure to comment on them down below.